Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft PowerPoint. In this module, I want to show you how you can use the design ideas to create your own theme, which will then sit as part of your own design set at the top here in the design and under themes. So what I've got on the right hand side is designer giving me some tips for this particular present presentation. So this one's quite a nice one. If I click on that, you can see that it's actually dropping a, a picture onto the screen. But if I want that to be part of my design, I need to go into a slide master and add that. Now, if you don't have the designer on your screen when you open PowerPoint, you need to do this. You need to go to file down into options and tick this little option here automatically show me design ideas so every time you open powerpoint that will display this list of design ideas and it's on the general tab so I'll just cancel that off so now i've got my design idea and let's say um i want this to be part of my design set at the top so i'm going to copy that picture copy it so control c to copy then I'm going to the view tab and selecting slide master and that's where I need to put this and I'm going to put it on the very top one which means that it will be available for all the slides the subset underneath this master so if I click on there paste that picture in control V now what it's done there it's covered everything up I quite like it though it's covered everything up picture format what I need to do is send this picture to the back not backwards to the back so everything else comes through and then you might want to play around with the uh, contrast on this or fade it out slightly look at the transparency options if it's too prominent this picture um, that one looks okay to me so does that one to be honest I'm going to leave it on that one now once you've done that that's how you've got it looking everything's cool then you need to Go back to the slide master tab and where it says themes, you give it a name. We'll save this as a theme, save current theme, and I'll just call it twist. Twister, actually, because that's what it looks like, a twister. It goes in the Microsoft Templates document themes area. Just save that. And then if I close slide master down and get myself a new presentation that won't have that on so I'll just do control N for new now this is just a blank one it's just got my logo on there but if I go to design I should have that twister sitting in there there she blows so I'll click on that and now that's come on top of my logo it's got rid of my logo and as I come down the left hand side the next slide type is a bullet list I can just type rubbish there for now you can see that and as you come down all the different um, slides ha have this background now when i'm looking at that background it probably is a bit prominent so maybe i should have faded it out a little bit more before i actually saved it into into this but if i just go home and just change a different slide to one of the other ones so um we're gonna have picture and caption yeah so you've got different options there you can get a picture in there all your slides part of that slide master set will have this theme. So that's all I want to talk about in this little video, how you can use, capture, if you like, the design ideas, create your own theme from them, and then you just have them in your own design set on the ribbon at the top there. So hopefully that was of use. Thank you for your time. I'll catch you in the next one.